Give God 60 seconds. Let us pray to our gracious God. Heavenly Father, you are the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last. You are the creator of the universe, the maker of heaven and earth. You are the God of all things, seen and unseen. You are the light in the darkness, a refuge for the weary and a stronghold for the weak. Your majesty fills the heavens. Your glory fills the earth. Today I seek your holy presence. Make your presence known to me, Lord. Holy Spirit, you're the one who formed me, who knows every thought of my mind, every beat of my heart, and every detail of my life. Father, I invite your Holy Spirit into my life. Holy Spirit, please fill me, guide me, teach me, and empower me. Be my ever-present friend and help from the time I wake up until when I lay my head to sleep. May I feel your comforting presence in my life, not just now, but every single moment of every single day. Lord, may your Holy Spirit fill up all the space around me. May the Holy Spirit be everywhere inside me so I can feel God's special power and live like one of God's children. Come upon me, Holy Spirit. May you fill up my spirit, my soul, and my mind so there's no room for anything that's not from God. Fill me up so much that when I get any attack from the enemy, all the enemy will see is you. Father, fill me with your presence and help me live the way God wants me to live. I'm inviting you to come and stay in my heart, to always be with me and to be in my home. Holy Spirit, I want you to shape my mind and my thoughts. Change me so that I can think in a new and better way. Father, I ask for strength. I thank you, Lord, that you are my strength and shield. When I am weak, you are strong. I thank you, Lord, that I can run to you knowing that you will give me the strength to keep going. Lord, may you give me wisdom. Today, you are the source of all wisdom. Help me to make wise choices, to say the right words, and to live in a way that pleases you. Father, I pray for good health in my body, which serves as the dwelling place for your Holy Spirit. Lord, I pray for complete and divine health from the top of my head to the soles of my feet. I ask for your healing touch. I pray that each cell, each organ, each system within my body functions exactly as you designed it to. May my body be strong and able to fight off any illness or disease that might try to attack. I pray for protection from harm and danger and for you to shield me from any harmful substances or practices that could harm my health. Lord, I pray for your blessings. Every good thing comes from you and I ask that you would pour out your blessings on me. May you bless the work I do, bless the people I love, bless the life I live. But even more than that, help me to be a blessing to others. Use me to bring joy, help, and hope to the people around me. Father, I ask for your divine protection. There are many dangers and problems in the world, but I know that you're my protector. You're my safe place, my shield. Keep me safe from harm, deliver me from evil, and keep me close to you. Lord, I am grateful that the Holy Spirit is my helper. Lord, may your Holy Spirit help me remember that when God is on my side, nothing can stand against me. I pray that the Holy Spirit will always remind me that nothing can take God's love away from me. Holy Spirit, in difficult times, may you remind me that nothing, not life or death, not angels or demons, not the things that worry me today, nor the things that scare me about the future, can ever separate me from the love of God. May the Holy Spirit remind me that I am precious to God and help me understand who I am through Christ Jesus. Holy Spirit, change me. Make me more like Jesus. Fill me with the fruits of your spirit, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Lord, help me to show the fruits of the spirit in my life, not just for my own good, but also for the benefit of the people around me. As I say this prayer together with everyone listening, for every person opening their heart to you right now, I ask that you fill them with your Holy Spirit and with your love for anyone who needs strength to get through the day. Holy Spirit, may you give them strength and courage. For anyone who woke up feeling hurt or in pain, Holy Spirit, may you be their comforter. Help them to feel calm when their heart is worried. For the person who feels lost and needs some help figuring out what to do, I ask Holy Spirit that you be like a good friend, giving them leading and direction. Lord, thank you for hearing this prayer and for everyone who is listening. Thank you, Lord, for being my father, my friend, my helper, and my guide. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 
Jesus said in Matthew 18, when two or more agree on anything in prayer, it will be done. Drop an amen. If you agree with me, you may want to save this video for late and pass it to someone who needs it. God bless you.